Good morning, Snippets. Happy Thanksgiving, or I guess the day after Thanksgiving for the time you see this. But for us, it's Thanksgiving. So in the past, in this time, it is currently Thanksgiving. Today, in my life, it is Thanksgiving. Now that we've established that. <laughs> this shirt I'm wearing is, I actually told you guys like how I ruined a shirt by staining it, and I gave my mom like some clothes to work on. This is the shirt I gave her to work on. There was like a big red stain, like all right here, because like I spilled pasta all over it, and it's completely gone. My mom is like a clothes genius, so she fixed this. She fixed my shoes. Um, there was like a little thread loose, like right here, on the little elasticy part thing, and she fixed that. And then what else? Oh yeah, I had like a loose thread on the sleeve of my sweater. She fixed that. So my mom is basically just a genius. So there's that. <laughs> so another one of my problems with living in like a small town is, okay, so let me rewind. At Baylor, since I live in a dorm, I'm blessed with unlimited hot water whenever I want it. Or cold water. You know, like it's, oh, I, I, I can have whatever temperature I want. Not necessarily like the, the level that I want, like the hot water is very like mildly hot in a sink. Well, okay, no, that's not true, but we don't have as much control over, like, how hot or how cold it gets when, but we still get hot water or cold water whenever we want it. Back here at home, the hot water comes much quicker than it does at Baylor, but it lasts, like, eight minutes. <laughs> and I forget that whenever I'm taking a shower. Okay, so my shower regimen is, like, shampoo, conditioner, uh, body wash, uh, face wash. And so I do the shampoo and then I rinse it and then I put my shampoo in and while the shampoo's setting or no I put the conditioner in while the conditioner's setting in and I put the body wash and then I rinse both off at the same time and then after all that the last step is I wash my face and whenever I shower at home I always get to my last step of washing my face and then right as I'm about to start the water gets cold so my shower is just like a minute or two too long for the hot water to last and so I have to like run like race as like because I can feel the temperature like slowly start to like just get unbearably cold and there's no turning back and so I just have to like run really really fast really fast to wash my face before the water turns like absolutely frigidly cold <laughs> and so yeah that's a problem with living in a small town and I forget that that's a thing whenever I come here because I'm blessed with hot or cold water all the time whenever I want it. Oh, and also, the water here is soft water. Waco water is hard water. Like, whenever, like, it hits you, it's, like, hard. But here, it's, like, soft. When, like, whenever the water hits you, it's really soft. And it feels really slimy and gross. Like, whenever I take a shower, I feel like I need to take another shower just to, like, get all the slime off from the soft water that I'm bathing in. So, yeah, small town probs. <laughs> I Hello. She decided to make an entrance in here today. Thanksgiving at my house is so crazy. I'm not gonna take you out there just cause I don't know if I wanna bear you through that, but I'll just like peek you through the window. See if we can see a little bit of what's going on out there. Just, okay, so the festivities go all the way down to the back of the house and there's some stuff that goes on over there. So basically it's just the whole house is crazy during Thanksgiving in my house. I think this year, we had like the lowest number for Thanksgiving that we've ever had. And our number this year was like 30, I think. Well, not ever, but like in recent years, it's the lowest that we've had. And yeah, so 30 is our low number. So Thanksgiving is just, and holidays in general, more people come for Christmas than Thanksgiving too. So holidays are just kind of crazy around here. So that's, yeah, that's my family for you. Alrighty guys, I just took a really intense nap. I call it the post-Thanksgiving dinner food coma nap, or what did I say on Twitter? It was like the do-nothing-a-thon. So, I'm very attractive right now, but uh, I'm going back to school tomorrow, and I'm waking up at 6 a.m., which is very early for me, so I don't know how that's going to happen, but... I'm gonna go to bed so I can at least attempt to wake up that early. So I will talk to you guys tomorrow. So I will see you guys tomorrow for at least another minute. Good night!